Look at them big bushy eyebrows. Welcome back, Primation. We are back with Ark Survival Evolved. If you missed episode two, I will link it in the top right hand corner. As you can see, we got this girl right here. We called her Tripod. She was level 86, I think it was. Tames out 44 or 46 levels more. She's amazing. We tied up her, her harness or her saddle even. We have got Leonardo and I know Jacora's fault. She died. Of course, she didn't. She's a liar. <laughs> and she's a little ledge. I'm going to keep her around. She'll be tanking some sort of tame at one point. That's why I'm keeping her around. But for now, if you recall last episode, we've done some building and stuff in there. We've got some metal. There were tons and tons and tons of pterodons over here. And now look. Poor, poor Stellis. Okay, she can't play Ark. It's not working on the PC. So I promised I'd tame a flyer and I'd call it Stellis. So that's what we're doing this morning. We're going to head over here, see what pterodons are. Are. Hopefully catch one, tame it and make it R. So let's see what one we can get. I, I don't know if you need different stuff to tame them, but I might try and tame them later on. But look, there's a couple landed over here. Let's, I, th I think there's two 68s around here. And that's it. So I've got the bowlers. If you didn't know, bowlers are the best for taming pterodons. So what you need to do is see if you can find one. Level 68, was it? Uh, 68, Mal, do you know what? Let's do it. Bowler it so it can't move. And now what you want to do is shoot it in the head. And count to five. No! I meant to whistle passive. Whistle passive. God damn <laughs> <laughs> tripod tripod okay so hold t as you can see they're, they're naturally on attack my target so whistle passive and that means they will not attack what you're trying to fight so you the other level 68 you are right let's try and get you that'll do plonk you down right now that means they won't move now shoot them in the head count to five one two three four and he's down straight away wow that was very very quick right these they're torpor wait oh crap the Torpor, which is this here, goes down super quick. And when it goes to zero, they wake up. These are very different to other tames. These wake up super quick. Now, there's two ways to tame these. For you that are new to Ark, you've got standard meat or you've got prime meat. The best way to... Oh, a blue drop. The best way to tame any herb or any carnivore is to tame with prime meat. So what we're going to do is we're going to get a little bit hungry. We're going to go get this drop whilst he starts getting hungry. Now, hopefully what we can do is we can find some sort of animal or some sort of dinosaur even that can give us prime meat. These guys don't, so we ain't got to worry about those. I'm going to try and get this drop real quick, see what's in it. Now, over here, we did see a Sarko last time. So what I'm hoping to do is find another Sarko, kill it, get the prime meat from the Sarko, and feed it to the Pterodon. Let's see if we can do that. It seems now the Sarko has been killed. You see here, these are beaver huts, these things here, or beaver dams. You can get poles and cement paste from them, but there are beavers, which I want to actually tame some of those. They might be one of our first... Gather a tamers. Uh, I'm not seeing anything that gives prime meat at the moment. But she will wake up fairly soon, or he will wake up. So it'll be quite quick. Sometimes there's a Therizino over here. So I'm just checking if there's a little Therizino over this way. If not, we may. Oh, we, uh, it's just um, piranhas. We may tame with just standard meat for this one. The idea of getting the flyer is to be mobile. We don't want to stay here forever. This is like a starter island, an early game bit. What we want to do is move up and away and further into the hills where there's more bad dinos. Better resources, that kind of stuff. But for now, a, a, just an early game tame is the most important thing. Sorry, an early game flyer is the most important thing. But I'm not seeing anything that gives Prime. Well, I'm not seeing anything, actually. <laughs> that knows something gives Prime. There is nothing here. Prime meat is what we're after. And I'm not seeing a single dino. Let her know something that gives Prime. Little look over here. If not, we'll quickly head back. Uh, more turtles. There's absolutely nothing here. Okay, in that case, we're going to use standard meat for now. You, you can kind of pre-plan your tames. What I tend to do is when I'm going for later game stuff is I'll either trap a couple of dinosaurs that I can use later on for the prime meat when I need it or I'll just take something down close to where there is prime meat. So um, that, that's kind of what you do later game. Early game, you just make do with what you've got. Get through as you can. God damn piranhas. Get out of the way. You get through as you can. If you can just get through here. I don't mind him attacking my dinosaur. It stops him attacking me. That's <laughs> all well and good. <laughs> She'll survive. Um, just so you know, Primation, I have bumped the rates up just a tiny bit. And what I mean by rates is the dino health and damage. Um, again, this, this series is going to go on for a, a good few weeks. Um, but I want to move on to other islands. And more importantly, I want to move on to the new DLCs coming out. So for now, I'm just enjoying it, having fun, doing some bits. Why am I so tired? Can we not increase our stamina by crouching, I think? There we go. Um... Yeah, so for now, I've just give him a little bit more health, a little bit more damage, just so we can get more of the boss fights done, get more of the caves done. Like, I'm not really looking to do standard stuff. I want to just increase it, bump it up a little bit, get things done quicker, get things moving, 
just so you're aware, I have done that. Just, you know, for transparency reasons, I thought I'd tell you. Come on, guy. I'm sure he'll be fine. All right, let's go over here. Again, she could wake up at any moment. So I want to get down there as soon as possible. I don't want to put some... Oh, are you aggroed? You, you seem like you're aggroed. You feel like you're aggroed. Please don't be aggroed. I feel like they attack you. I don't know. All right, so let's check our torpidity. So as you can see, her torpidity is going down. And when it gets to zero, that means she wakes up. So her food is currently at 5.5. Five. So she will eat some of this. And her, where it says put food in inventory, that will start going up. Dude, you're right. I'm trying to do a video here. <laughs> right, now when she's down, I know people like um, GD are quite new to this. If they're down and they get hit or injured or you hit them, their taming efficiency will go down. What's, what's attacking me? What's attacking me? Uh, that was dino attacky noise. I feel like those birds are going to attack me. I don't know why. Anyway. Uh, was it Piranha? It may have been Piranha. But yeah, so if something attacks this 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 girl, or this boy even, she will lose tame and infinity. So I'll show you now. I'm going to put this food in there. And then watch the bar. Actually, let me show you. See that bar there? It says put food in inventory to tame. Watch that bar. Keep an eye on it. So she's eaten once. She'll probably eat twice. Oh, sorry. He will probably eat twice. Again, I have got the rates turned up massively for taming because I haven't got the time to sit around and tame. There you go. So he's on so time effectiveness 98.8 .8 and plus 33 levels. So he's 68 and he will tame with plus 33 levels on top of that. Oh, I keep hearing noises. Oh, they're attacking the fish in the water. So one more bit of food and we have our first flyer. And as promised, I will call her Stelis <laughs> to give it a second. And I'll bring you back once this is tamed. Bang, there it is. So I was doing some testing. I was watching around. Stelis it is. Um, when the food goes down by 50 points, down by 50 is when they'll eat again. Just so you know, in case you're doing the same as I am. So let's jump on this bad boy. Let's get you following tripod and not me. And let's get tripod following me because I can run faster than tripod. Right, this bad boy, I feel like I want to tame this as well. <laughs> if you're wondering, the best way to get levels, to get um, up levels in order to get saddles, is to craft narcotics. You, you gain levels so quick. I kind of want to see if we can get you. Let's chop these guys back. We might come back and get that. Just because it's a tech and I've never had a tech before. But let's get Stellis back. Um, I need to get half of a level. With half more of a level, we can actually build the saddle needed to ride Stellis and fly around and all that kind of good stuff. Um, and then we go get some crystal and some real metal. But the reason we're getting Stellis is she's going to bring us to somewhere good and glorious. She's going to take us to places that foot dinos can't. And I have actually enabled flyer speed because again i hate the fact they took that out i'm enjoying this series it may not be as you hardcore players play it but i bloody love it and i'm enjoying it nonetheless but let's get these guys home get a uh, half level so i might take tripod out kill a few things to get the half level and then we'll take stellis for a spin stellis stellis you're always getting in trouble <laughs> you're such a troublemaker oh maybe not uh maybe you are Oh, oh, hey, yo, yo, hey. Stellis, do me proud. Thank you, Stellis. And there's that level. So let's add a little bit more weight. Um, We're going to have to be careful on the weight of Stellis as well, because if we're actually too heavy on our side because of our you know, inventory or our tools, she would actually be weighed down as well. So let's see, how do we craft this? I think it's just high, actually. Uh, pterodon, 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 pterodon. It doesn't tell me. I hate it when it does this. Nine. We need <gasps> chitin, fiber, and hide. Have we got any? I did get one of those. Um. Oh, we have. Yeah. I did get one of those little uh, trilobites, I think it was. And I managed to kill it. And it gave me a black pearl, which I've only seen a few of in my time of playing Ark. Uh, nine. What do we need? We need more hide. Bang. Bang. Oh, nine. Done. All right. Let's put this bad boy on. And let's see. If, uh, if we're too much, if we have to get rid of some of our inventory to actually go for a bit of a fly around. Uh, the reason why I don't like actually naming my dinos is because they always die. <laughs> my first ever dino I tamed. I was like, like 20 minutes trying to find the right name, thinking it's all nice, all well and good. And it died even like 10 minutes. So Stelis, if you die, I can only but apologize. All right, so top right and corner, if you look at the weight, can I do this? Yeah, up here, the weight is on half, which is okay. It's not bad. More than anything, I believe stamina will be the main issue. So keep looking top right and corner. <gasps> fly. We have fly. Amazing. So stamina is draining quite quick. Uh, C. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, C really does take it down. Crap. Uh, let's just go over here. Right, there's a Sarko. That would give us some prime meat. Let me just land this bad boy. So now we know C, the C move, which was that spin attack we just done. 
really does drain your stamina. But as you can see, we can explore more of the island now. Oh, crap. We can do more things. <gasps> oh, bugger just nicked my cooked meat. Oh, crap. -oh. Get up, quick. Move. Come on. I'm probably still all my stuff. <gasps> oh, there's goddamn... I hate these little things. So they're Trodons, I think they are. He just stole all my food. There he is, that little bugger right there. I'm waiting for my stamina on the top right-hand corner to come back. Once it comes back... Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're going to see if we can duff this little guy up. If we kill him, we can get our stuff back. Where did he go? Where did he go? There he is. There we go. Right, did you drop my bag of cooked stuff? You did. <laughs> so they can steal things from you, so be very careful with them. There's another tech parasaur. I've never seen so much tech. Again, I haven't played Ark past a certain period, so stuff. There's a beehive. I've heard about them. Never used them. There's another pterodon. Now we've got flight. Trust me, things are going to get so much easier. You can scout dinos. You can go places. What level you 12? Huh? You can go places, scout places. Like, there's so much more you can do. There is a blue drop right there. We might go check that out and see what's in there super quick. Ah, oh, my favorite dino in all of Ark. Spinosaurus. There was a time when everyone loved Rexes, and it was fights between Rexes and Spinos way before Gigas and that. Oh, got lands of stamina, crap. Oh. And yeah, Spinos were always my thing. Always. Whenever we attacked in PvP, me and the boys always, always just go through the water in the Spinos, not being seen, and just sneak up on them, and it was bloody fantastic. But I'm waiting for my stamina to come up, and I'll show you it. Let me check my stamina a bit more. This bad boy right here. Let me go nice and slow. K mode it if we can. Oh, 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 up we get. There we go. This, look at it. Just look at it. Oh, what's going on? Why is it kind of funny? Uh, my stamina's nearly gone. Look at it. It looks amazing. I love these things. I think Rexes are more powerful, but these have got more speed and agility. And look, it just looks so good. Uh, I can't scout this level. <laughs> and I'm way, 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 way behind. I can't even tame that just yet. So what we need to do now, what I'm actually going to do, sorry, is I'm going to get some crystal. I think right where my head is, just up there. I think there's some crystal. I'm just trying to slow them up my over there. We haven't got much stamina. This is the swamp lane, but it's super bloody dangerous. Like, you don't want to be here any game. You'll just get your ass handed to you something rotten. As you can see, there's Carnos, there's Spinos, there's Sarkos. You can get swamp fever, you can get leeches. Got to be super careful, but I'm going to try and make them up here and get some crystal. Now we've got flyers. Now we're able to actually fly it. I'm happy. I I'm a super duper duper happy chap. I think now we're going to be able to really make a, a big difference on this series. Oh, run out of stamina. Oh, and there's raptors everywhere. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, they're little micro raptors, I think they are. I've not actually encountered them before, so I don't know how they work. Just there. Micro raptors here. crap -o. These are metal nodes. These are full-on proper metal nodes here. We haven't seen those yet in this series, but if, if you're ever looking for them, just go to a mountain area. You're bound to find them. I'm just trying to avoid that raptor while I get a little bit of stamina. I don't know what that was. I was a bee. <laughs> If we can quickly go here, I just want this. It's the only reason why I'm here. This bad boy. Let's all passive real quick. Bang, bit of crystal. Might need a bit more than actually. Don't kill Stellis. Don't kill Stellis. Leave her alone. Don't kill Stellis. Phew. Right, we're over in combat. Can we land? Right, get rid of the stone. Oh, that is a lot of crystal as well. Can we just about make it? Just about. There's a couple of Titan soldiers that are called right behind me. Let's quickly land because they're going to keep following. We might. Are they running or flying? Oh, they're running. And as you can see up here, we've actually got a bit of a buff, a bit of a debuff. Top right hand corner. I don't have to check. Oh, H, I remembered. You are losing stamina. Let's wait until that buff is gone or debuff is gone before we head back. There's another tech parasaur. Jesus. Yeah, I don't want to move until we can get some stamina because without stamina, we're pretty much screwed. I'll tell you what, I'll see you back at base. We're making a crystal spyglass. It's just hit daytime. It's a little bit dark, but I'm trying to swing over here with this spyglass to see what level... 104 female! I want it so badly. It just wrecked that car note. I want that. Um, you need a crap ton of, of narcotics to be able to keep those things down. So we're not ready for it just yet, but I want to check it out. I am on the lookout for another pterodon of, of higher level or an RG. RGs are more in the center around high cliffs so we're not seeing any just yet i've come across quite a few um pterodons like this bad boy oh stamina stamina gosh stamina so bad like this one just over here 
Um, but he was a level 12, was it? Level 16, sorry. Level 16. And I've checked a couple other level 20s, level 30-ish. <laughs> level 30-ish. Level 30-ish. There's not really many around here, if I'm being honest. That Sarko's fighting that uh, trike right there. Those, are they Baryonyx? I think they are. I've never tamed one of those. Level 40, that's not a bad early game tame as well. I'm checking everywhere. I'm not seeing any decent levels. We haven't ventured too far from base. Let's face facts. Um, and I've done that for a good reason. Until I've got flight, I didn't want to go too far. Because if our tame dies... Oh, I can't see her. If our tame dies, we're pretty much screwed. And we can't get it until we get back. Or find a way to get to the body level 20. So yeah, there's not really much around here. So I think what we're actually going to do... We are going to go out and go for a proper high level RG or high level Pterodon. Um, not today. Not today. We've got, we've got flight. We've got status, which is good. I'm actually pretty happy we've got this one. What, what level are you? Level four. <laughs> but I think all in all, we're actually going to um, go and get this one over here. Wait, let me get my, my bits together. We're going to go and tame the... Uh, what was it called? Uh, the electric kind of thing. Oh, what's it called? Tech. The tech uh, parasol. Because I want to see what it's like. I don't know. I've never done it. I don't know, what, I don't know if you tame it with berries or with what. Saying that, we, we may need to get some berries. I'll tell you what. Let me get some berries. I'm going to go tame that bad boy as well. Let's get close. Let's get close. What level are you? There's no way we can take you out. 192. With the Sarko there. That's that's just not going to happen. Oh, crap. That's just not going to happen. Uh, I kind of want to take the Sarko down, but I know I won't be able to. Do you know what? Back and forward, back and forward. I'm going to go get Tripod, and we're going to try and take him down. Yeah, he's still aggroed. He he still wants my booty. He He's full on coming for me. I've called Stellis. Oh, sorry, I've, I've called Tripod. He's on his way. <laughs> I've whistled him over. I'm probably going to leave Stellis up here and jump on Tripod. I think. Let me let me just whistle passive. Just so I know nothing's going to happen. But he's level 72. This could be very bad. This could be very, 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 very bad. Oh. Oh. Oh, you, you stay away. Do you know what we're going to do? We're going to switch you for you. And we're going to... Go on. Oh, we got it. Don't get you there? Come on, let's do this. Let's go. Level 72. What the pushback? That pushback. Oh, he snap is something different. Oh, oh, we smashed it. Oh, okay, yeah. Fair play. Do you know what? <laughs> These used to be so hard. I'm oh, sorry, it used to be so easy. Now they're, they're kind of difficult. Uh, we'll take you. I think we'll just duff you up. What do you give? You do give prime, hide, raw. Just for the XP. One, anything. Okay. Right, now you. Uh, actually... Can we whistle Stellis? Follow us. Now we're safe. Now the carnivore's gone. We should be safe to tame this bad boy over here. Right, tripod's following Stellis. Right, cat. Does this just act as normal or is there something different we need to do? Interesting to find out nonetheless. Let's go. Right, number four. Oh, you coming for me. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Five. I, I don't know how long those bowlers last for. It used to be five seconds. Quick, quick. I don't know if tech ones are like aggressive and they come for you or what. One, two, three, four, five. He's getting bloody. Oh, he died. Oh, man. Right, can we hack you up? I'm guessing maybe, maybe this one. What do you get? Oh, oil and electronics. Oh, okay. That, that's a bit of a thing. We didn't get him. I'm not sure I've got something different with those. But nonetheless, we've got some electronics, which is... A, do you know what? We could just harvest those electronics. That's quite interesting. Um, all in all, I'm going to leave this episode here, Primation. We did get Stellis. We're now actually flying. We've got the Spyglass, which is all well and good. We can do things. Ooh. Uh, crutch shot. <laughs> we can do things. Um, we, we've got everything going. I did do a little bit of work to the base. I, uh, just during the night time. I just made it out of stone and so forth. But if you like this episode, please smash like and consider subscribing if this is your cup of tea. All in all, I've had a great time. Might be a bit shorter one today because I wanted to just get the tame done and get that sorted. Get a few bits done in the background, which I have done. Uh, we know we can take out Sarkos. We've kind of got mobile flight now. Now, next episode, we're going to go and get either a better Pterodon or, and or an RG. An RG is the big thing that we need because that will really help us. We're probably going to move base next episode as well. There's quite a few things we could do. Now we're airborne. There's so much more we could do. So again, if you enjoyed it, let me know in the comments below. And all, I'll see you all in the next episode.